Oh man, episode 11, we still haven't beat Misty. Uh, Alright, uh, where were you last time? I don't know where you last time, whatever. Uh, we're going to Fuchsia City though, I know that. Uh, trying to see if we can skip past this guy. Uh, we're trying to get some rods. We're trying to get some rods. Uh, barely avoided that guy. Still don't have cut, so we can't get through there. Uh, I just want—I just want to get a good ride on this. Like, I want to get a good ride. We're gonna like meander around these folks and this one too, maybe. Mm, yep. Cool. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wild fight. That's fine. Wild fight is fine. Quagsire. Okay. Okay, that sounds like a, uh... Mmm, we're gonna try to flail it to death. Let's see if we can get a 2 at KO. No, Not at all. Okay, ooh, almost went down too far. Okay, maybe through no trainer fights, that's good. Uh, I guess we'll check the top floor again. Maybe there's some different stuff in the binoculars, because you know, we're much further south. Uh, or not. You know, it's just, it's just gonna be better. Alright, we find our way into... This is this is Saladon City's music. What have you guys done? <laughs> uh, Warden's home. Okay, everyone's got that same. Uh... My grandpa is the Safari Zone War. Then. Get some get some goodies. What's in the box? Mm -hmm. Oh! Surf obtained! Oh, it does pay to rummage through garbage. I always knew it. It's amazing. So we don't have to go on the safari zone then. Nice. Are these signs we can read? I wonder if he's grinning with his gold teeth. Hmm. Sweet. So we got Surf, we just need someone who can actually learn it. A strong water type attack. Top top tier water type attack. I mean, I hope they remove Skull from this game. I hate Skull. I mean... I guess? So, her grandpa's house sitting for Bill, okay. These weird slow Pokemon on Cycling Road. Mm. Leader Wait a minute. That's not Koga. What's going on here? Hold up. Hold up. Doesn't what? What? Okay, well, I guess uh, I guess for the remake they decided to uh, go ahead and have Koga pass the uh, reins off to his daughter, so that's interesting. There's a Lapras. Uh, let's see, where is the? I could have sworn. Oh, there's a uh, another one of those trees. Oh, it's Sudowoodo. Okay, the very image of yes, that is what I, the first thing I think of when I think of trees. Then they got Snorlax locked in a cage. I mean, I guess it probably doesn't care that much. Australian. Ah, food and long naps. Those are two of the best things in the world. Okay, here's the Mart. Can we even check the Mart since we got another badge? Uh, I think. Oh, I think Revive is new. I think Revive is new. Let's, uh. That's Steve. We got a lot of money now! Holy carp! Let's buy two Revives. In case I balls it, balls it up. So I guess we can try the Safari Zone. I mean... <sighs> Where was the... Oh, what is this? <laughs> look, at that, look at that sprite for Onyx. Looks so nice. 
Okay, so burnt berry, is, as I think I said like several parts ago, I'm pretty sure is the one that heals freeze. The danger this is. Oh, I guess we could go in the safari zone. No time limit? Broken. Um, maybe if I get a rod? <laughs> That's pretty crazy. Actually, I said I wanted Bliss, didn't I? Okay, so Koga joined the Elite Four. Okay, so it's kind of like... Um, it's kind of like uh, GSC then, right? That's neat. But then he left and nobody's heard from him. Wait, what? Oh, oh. Koga's succeeded him as the gym leader after he joined the Elite Four, but then he left and nobody's heard from him. I, th I think he's out training in some place called Ho Ho End. Ho End? Could be. Let's see, it's where he's in my office. Hmm, okay. It was once part of the Elite Hmm. Okay, so I wonder who the So now I don't know who the Elite Four in this game is. Cool. It's in the trash can. Anything good? Nope. Ah, <sighs> see, I think the room... The room... The place with the... With the rod was, like, right here. Can we, can we go in the back? I thought you could go through the back. Oh, well. Uh, there wasn't anything else in the boxes, right? Okay. I think it was just surf, but like that's that's pretty good. It's pretty good indeed. Um, so now I am unsure where to get another fishing rod. I mean, we could try the fishing rod. We're just gonna find magic harps, but we could give it a shot. Uh, let's see, is there any water convenient around here? I can't remember if there's any to the left or not. I mean, obviously there's a... There's a trainer right there. I guess we can just go south of Fuchsia. That should be fine. I seem to recall these guys around here used to have, like, birds. Yep. It's birds. And in fact, it's Shadow Duo. So that's nice that some things stay the same. Hmm. Uh, we're still in Flail range, and... Six see, 16 is like... It's enough so that Flail is better than Tackle, but it's not so little HP that it's going to get me killed, necessarily, against stuff that's not super strong. So, I actually don't mind being in, like, middling Flail range. As long as Flail is at least, like, 60-plus base power. <laughs> uh... I still want quick attack though. Right, so we're just gonna try to, try to mow things down with Eevee as much as we can. And try to get something going on. Oh, which reminds me, the um there was a I think there was a happiness uh checker on thing. Oh, please don't die. <laughs> this one boy was level 16. Uh we're gonna go into Maker then. Alright, make her and we're gonna rock throw. Let's go pursuit. I'm ninety percent sure that pursuit has only ever been a dark type attack. So I guess yeah, I mean that makes sense if, if steel's in the game, then dark's gonna be in the game, right? I uh So let's look at Evie's stuff. Uh Okay, so yeah, so you can kind of just see the, uh, the happiness right there. And even this Magnemite, which I feel like I want to get a better one, but stuff is not easy. You know, I, one thing I will say about the Pokemon fleeing is it does encourage you to use stronger balls. Because if Pokemon never flee, you kind of just have all the time in the world to just chuck balls at them, right? So if they will flee... 
if they flee, then there's more of a reason to use the you know, higher tier balls. Do. I mean, it only has room for like 150 some odd Pokemon. I want like 800 plus. That's what I want, but oh well, they decided to not put all the Pokemon in this game. So be it. Uh, okay, yeah, we can get back up there. Uh, what is this building actually? Cerulean Sun? Oh, okay! We received a pass. I mean, we've been to Cerulean City, but like, why would. <laughs> Uh, any oh, can I can we fish in here? So let's select the old rod. Uh, I'm gonna give it a sh couple of shots. Oak, I've never even talked to you, except that one time at the start of the game. Oh, you don't have to press it. <laughs> okay, we'll see if... What are the odds it's a Magikarp? Answer, about 100%. Oh, it's not a Magikarp! Hold on! That's a Krabby. Hmm... What, what might we be able to find, I wonder? So I guess it's worth giving this a couple of goes. Um, Krabby can learn Surf, but Kingler's physical oriented, so... There is the magic carp that we come to expect. See, so I don't want magic carp. I don't really want Kingler. Like, Kingler's, Kingler's cool enough, but... So I guess we're just gonna be here to, uh, to fish for, uh, for a little bit and see what we can, uh, see what we can acquiesce of. You know, maybe I should uh, follow my own advice and go buy some Great Balls. I mean, Great Ball is my favorite ball, so... Like, this gets going get so expensive. But then again, if we can refight Gym Leaders, we can probably make do with the whole uh, thing. Also, we'd be kind of keen to uh, have Eevee be... Well, you know what, they're like level 10. They're not even worth the time, honestly, to fight. Not really. Starting to believe that the Krabby was a fluke. Starting to think the Krabby was a fluke. At least it's actually uh, hooking things reasonably often. shakes. Well, there's Krabby at least, so it's not all magic carps, so that's good. I don't really, really want Krabby. Let's see, I think I'm actually going to go back to the Mart, maybe? See if we can get some, uh, get, get some Great Balls. Seems like a good idea. Just cause this whole, like, Pokemon fleeing thing is... It's like, uh, I kinda want some actual high-grade balls that'll actually catch, so... Hmm, so let's get in here and buy a couple of Great Balls at least. Um, sure, I'll buy nine. Oh, right then. 
Let's check out our town map right quick, actually. We can check the map here, right? Oh, you know, I guess it's, it's brown, right? I guess it's brown because of Eevee. That makes sense. Yeah, so we're here in Fisher City. We got like Route 19, Route 20. Cinnabar Island. What is the thing right there? But it's not getting on. There's like a, see, there's like a brown dot between Seafoam and Cinnabar. Radio Tower. Hmm. What is that other dot? I don't know. Let's see, so where should we fish next? Um, I'm trying to think it was a place to fish. I feel like there was a place to fish in this town. But like, maybe that's just uh, in the Safari Zone? I still feel like I want to get another rod. I mean, I'm pretty sure, pretty sure that, um, like, I know there are rods in, like, Johto, but, I'm, <laughs> like, that's not real, right? Okay, so I guess you can just kind of go wherever then. We got this, the, the nice music, too. Okay, I'm just trying to find a... Water spot. So there's no like step counter, right? Oh, that's pretty sweet. Oh, here we go. All right, we'll uh, we'll do a few of these. Who knows? Might get a... okay. We're not gonna get a teeny with an old rod. <laughs> That'd be pretty wild. We can get crabs though. Can definitely get crabs with an old rod. It's a little bit higher level too. Level, uh, level 10 would, uh, would take a mite longer to get ranked up. So let's do a few of these here. And, uh... Okay, well at least the Krabbies are, uh, are coming around a little bit more often. Might differ from area to area, too, but, like, really would like to get a water type. I'm a big fan of this 100% bite ratio. Oh, shit. Okay, so for some reason I've always pronounced this thing Chin Chow, even though now, now I know it's Chincho. And it, the weird thing is, its Japanese name looks less Japanese than its English name. <laughs> its uh, Japanese name is like Chanchi or something like that. Also, we, we lost the 100%. At least it's a quick deconfirm. So, so I guess we have some options here. Um, I mean, lantern's pretty good. I mean that that would be weird because like I came into this expecting only you know Gen One. But oh, Stardius! Oh, it's level five though. <laughs> I'm gonna try to catch it. Though. Um, Love to use a star here. Let's uh, let's try to paralyze it, I guess. Oh, we got the psychic TM too. Hmm. I think it needs to be Starmie to use uh, to use that though. Uh, yeah. Let's just do poison powder. That way we'll get some damage on there, and like it'll probably run before anything else happens, right? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna try throwing uh, until it's pr shown and proven that the the star you wants to run. We can do that, and I'm d yeah, I, th I think I want to use star you this run actually. <sighs> Come on, so you don't you get in the ball. Yeah, thankfully, we get to use conventional catch mechanics for this, and not uh, goofy safari zone stuff. Also, I'm running on pokeballs. <laughs> A little low, not not too low. Yeah, unfortunately, I, I can't really uh, hit it at all if it's level five. Like, yeah. I don't have the Ultra Ball there. I don't really want to use that. So I'm actually really glad that they made the old rod not totally useless. 
you know, the, or at least, you know, that only gets Magikarp, because that's kind of annoying, you know, like, well, you can fish, but not really, you can just get Magikarp. Alright, Stardew, you're on a clock, get in the ball. And yeah, I'll probably try to catch uh, a couple of them. Actually, see what we can, uh... Nice, sorry, we got one. Assuming this one doesn't have amazing stats, we'll probably try to catch a couple of them. So, we're just gonna do the same thing and not nickname it yet. So, it's poisoned. Let's see, sturdy body- Ooh! Ooh! Max special and max defense. Average HP. High attack, which doesn't really matter. Low speed is kind of a bummer, though. But, like, Starmie's already so fast that I think that's gonna be fine. Do we just wanna go with this? Tell you what, I'll do a, a few more fishings right here. But uh, if we don't get a if we don't get another one in the next like two minutes or so, we'll uh, we'll just go ahead and call it a video and see what we can do. See, so, yeah, I'm definitely interested in that like max special attack, and I guess in special defense too. Corsola, that's got to be pretty rare. I'm actually I'm actually shocked the old rod is getting this uh, this quality stuff that's level 15 as well. Uh, I'm sure about that. <laughs> so some really cool stuff. That's a Johto poke too, good grief. So it's, there's honestly an astounding variety right here. And on, on top of that, like, none of these are Magikarp either. So... so Safari Zone is, uh, is definitely a great place here. Well worth the uh, the 500 admission fee. <laughs> we're we're gonna wreck so much stuff with the uh, with the max special attack. We got max special attack surf incoming. We got max attack earthquake. And then we've got Eevee who sometimes does all right. So so if I'm gonna use Starmie, that means I probably see now we're in a weird spot. Now we're in a weird spot because. I want to use Starmie. I kind of wanted to use. Um, goodness, uh, Magnemite. I kind of want to use Magnemite, but if I do that, then like my only option for Eevee is Fla uh, Flareon. I mean, we could just leave Eevee unevolved, but like its attack is really bad, so that doesn't seem. That doesn't seem like a great idea. Okay, good, we need star. Alright, so we'll do this and, uh, we'll try to catch this one. Level 5 only, though. So we kind of do the same thing. I guess I should have just put, um... Should have just put... I mean, I guess I could go into this one. What moves does he even have? Okay, just tackling hard enough right now. So we'll just do the same deal. I would probably take a like balance of speed and spatak over the uh, pretty poor speed but the max spatak. So, um, I don't even feel like wasting a ball. I'm just gonna spam poison powder on it until it gets uh, a little bit of damage on there. I guess we can use stun spore as well. When it gets under like the S, we'll uh, we'll start maybe throwing balls. I guess the good thing about it being level five is it's not much of a threat. So. I find it kind of funny that you know the Safari Zone is the one place where normally in the games that's where the Pokemon flee. But here it's so far we haven't had anything flee in the Safari Zone. But then again, I guess we also can't throw bait or anything like that to keep them from playing, so... Um, Alright, sweet. This one came along a lot easier. Alright, I think I know what I want to nickname it, too. I'm just waiting to see which one, uh... Ooh, it's got a... a held on. What is this? Star Piece, maybe? It is a Star Piece. Nice, we can sell that. Yeah, Star Piece is the more expensive one, right? In the Stardust. Uh... <laughs> nice and zero special. 
so yeah um i think this one just wins like the the speed is not great but i think it's gonna be like good enough and i, I really can't argue with that oh it's, <laughs> it's bulk it's bulky starmy <laughs> it's bulky starmy it is bulky starmy it's got max defense and max special so it's got max pedef too and the hp is at least average so all right we're gonna go with bulky starmy i guess so uh, we'll get it nicknamed next time. We should go ahead and save our game here in the Safari Zone. Thanks for watching, guys. Next time, next time, uh, I don't think we'll actually go fight Misty, but uh, we'll probably be training up our new Staryu. So that'll be great. Music getting good. Later days.